Hello, everybody. Andrea Mayeski again. So I just thought that I would hop on and talk about the hourly rate because everybody's asking me about the hourly rate. Now, it does depend on where you want to temp. So I'm talking specifically for a temp hygienist because that's what I do and that's the experience that I now have. So I'm talking about that. Now, it does depend on where you temp. Every city is different. For example, when I, when I was a temp in London, I made about... $36 per hour. Um, I found that, um, and when I worked actually in London full time, I made $30 per hour because I thought that was just normal. Um, I was in the same office for 10 years, 12 years, so I didn't think anything thing of it. But then when I started working somewhere else, they had just um, suggested that I start off at 35 per hour. So I'm like, okay, perfect. You know, that sounds awesome, right? But as a temp, I found that the most I was able to get was it was um, $35 per hour. I did ask for $38 per hour on Saturdays, and that seemed to be fine. Um, but I do have 13 years experience, so that might um, play into account too. Some say that that's a lot to ask for, and some say that's not enough to ask for. So I think it just depends on you, and it depends on the office. I know some temps making 45 per hour. So it just um, depends, even if you, if you only have a couple years experience. It depends on you and it depends on the office, but this video is just mainly for don't ask for $30 per hour, okay? So that's all I'm kind of saying, is don't cut yourself short, but don't expect to make $60 per hour either. The range seems to be at least the Kitchener area. So like London, Kitchener, Toronto, probably higher in Toronto, um, Guelph, uh, Mississauga, um, Woodstock, the range seems to be for a temp hygienist, $35 per hour to 45, okay? But that's just something that I've noticed. So if you have another um, range or number, let us know. Um, the most I've been able to make is $45 per hour, okay? Um, and that's, again, with some um, 13 years experience. Um, I did become a restorative hygienist about three years ago, but I'm not using that skill. If I was um, temping, for example, as a restorative hygienist, then I would ask for a lot more. But as a hygienist, that just seems to be kind of um, the range. So don't accept anything less than $35 per hour. For myself, I do not accept anything less than $40 per hour, only because I can work at a lot of other places for that amount. On Saturdays, I do ask for 45 per hour because it's harder to find a hygienist to work Saturdays. You can even take it a step further because we can. Um, if a office needs you to work an evening, ask for a higher amount because it's hard to find hygienists to work evenings and weekends. You wanna know why? Because we don't have to. We can find another um, another office that's not offering such, you know, not so nice hours, you know, who, who wants to work until seven if they don't have to? Who wants to work a Saturday if they don't have to? See, I don't mind, um, actually, because I'm not doing it full time. So I don't mind helping an office out, but for the right price. So $35 per hour to $45, I'd say. Um, if you're a newbie, like fresh out of school, then they might not pay you $35 per hour, only because they just simply might not. But hey, it can't hurt to ask, right? All they can do is say no. But I guess what I'm trying to say is don't accept anything less than $30, okay? There are some hygienists out there that are telling me, oh, well, in this office, I make $29. In this office, I make $30. Don't accept anything less than 30. If they don't like it, they'll just find somebody else. And I'm hoping that in time, we will all know to not accept anything less. So I hope this helps. Do not be afraid to stick to your, to your hourly rate. If they don't like it, say, okay, well, I can understand that. Um, but this is the rate that I get paid in other offices because I don't get sick pay. I don't get insurance. Um, I have to pay my own taxes. Um, so yeah, this is why I do make a little bit more. Um, but again, if that's not what your office wants, that's okay. Um, just let me know if you guys need me on short notice and I'd be happy to help you out. And they always, always say, oh no, hey, you know what? $45 per hour is fine, okay? They just try to shortchange you because why not? You know, why not pay you less if they can?
but don't let them. Okay, so I hope this helps a little bit. If you guys need any more help, just let me know.